It's my pleasure to have Brian Hoyer, who's the starting quarterback for the Michigan State Spartans. And it's a pleasure to have you on the show, definitely. Yeah, thanks for having me, man. Thanks. Absolutely. Talk about uh, Tess, what Tess has done for you in your training and uh, getting ready for the combine and pro day. Yeah, they've uh, they prepared me tremendously. Um, you know, I've taken a, a few tents off in almost every drill I've done. I've improved my vertical jump. So, uh, you know, they know what they're doing when they, when you come here. And they've really got it broken down into a science. And, and Brian and Skip and Kevin, these guys, uh, they work hard for you and they push you. And, and to be a bunch of, be around a, a group of guys here working out where you got people from all over the country coming in and working out and you, you, everyone's got the same goal. You know, everyone wants to make it to the NFL. So it's a good, a good environment to work out in. I gotta say, congratulations on the buzz that you're getting after, uh, you know, after, uh, you know, your senior year statistically wasn't as prolific. Yeah, I mean, for me, you know, like you mentioned, the stats weren't as good as my junior year. Um, we had lost, we lost our receiver and our tight end to the NFL, so we had a young group of receivers we had to bring along, and, and they came along real well. I mean, by the end of the season, we were really clicking. But uh, the biggest stat I think you judge a quarterback by is wins and losses, and we you know we won two more games. We went to a, a New Year's Day bowl game, and you know, as far as as I'm concerned, I mean. I had a chance to go and play in the East-West Shrine game, show my skills down there, and, and now I'm starting to make in that slow climb, I think, and, and try to create a buzz about myself. And um, the work I've been doing here is really going to help going into the combine, and I think you know my stock's just going to keep going up as, as the process goes on. Talk more about that 6-2 and two record in the Big Ten and 9-4 and, nine and four overall. I mean, wow, well, how things really clicked overall. Yeah, it did, and it was our second year with Coach Antonio, and, and people just bought into the system, and that was our goal going into this year was a, a New Year's Day bowl game. and. I mean, the teams we lost to, they, were, they weren't no slouches, you know what I'm saying? We lost to Ohio State, they were a BCS team. We lost to Penn State, a BCS team. Georgia, preseason number one, and we played them tough. I mean, we, we, were, we were in all of our games except for, I mean, we, we, uh, we lost some tough ones to Ohio State and Penn State. Uh, they put some points up on us, but every other game we were in it, we lost at Cal, you know, first game of the season. Like I said, we had some young guys playing their first game at Cal. Cal was good. They beat Miami, you know what I'm saying? So And we, and we played those guys tough, so... You know, Michigan State's in good hands with Coach Antonio and, and people are coming out. You know, we had a great running back in Javon Ringer who, who will be out there. So, um, you know, we, we had a good group of guys, a good group of seniors that really carried, uh, you know, our, our junior season over to our senior season and it even got better. Question about the East West Shrine game uh, that week of practice. Uh, well, you know, talk about uh, how, how you were feeling coming out and how confident because now McShay has you five uh, for quarterbacks overall, fifth overall. So, did that help you? That yeah, I think the East West Shrine game helped me a lot. Uh, you know, people probably look at you know, when you're looking through senior quarterbacks, you, you probably just go through a quick look at stats and be like, well, you know, Hoyer, his stats weren't as good. So, for me, I had the opportunity to go out there and show what I could do to the scouts, to like you said, Todd McShay. You know, he was there that week, and obviously he saw something to move me up. I don't even think I was on his top ten before that week. So he obviously saw something, went back and watched the film, and is seeing, you know, my skills and my ability. So uh, that was a great opportunity for me, and, uh, you know, I'm thankful to be able to do that. And now I can just continue on, go to the combine, and, and continue to show my skills. And I want to wish you the best of luck at the combine and pro day. When's pro day for Michigan State? Pro day is uh, March 18th at Michigan State, so we'll have a – I'm sure we'll have a good turnout. Like you said, like I said, we got myself, we got Javon Ringer, we got Otis Wiley, who's a safety that's coming out. We got a lot of good guys. We got some other guys that who weren't invited to the combine, but can be some prospects too. So I think we'll have a good turnout. Congratulations, Brian, and uh, looking forward to seeing you on Sundays in the league. Definitely. Thanks, man. Thank you. Thanks for having me.